Hi, Miles here, and I just want to show you this really simple little water wheel that uh, has been made by a good friend of mine. And uh, I've done a bit of work on it myself, the, the electrical side, and the, another friend has helped with the transmission. So it's been a bit of a joint effort. It's a really simple little water wheel. Uh, if you've got almost no drop of water and uh, not very much flow, and it's basically it's been made from a bicycle wheel. And if I just slow it down, I can show you. It's like a BMX wheel, like a 20 inch BMX wheel with a great big cog on it or sprocket. And these here are, I think they're two inch pipes, two and a half inch pipes. that have been cut in half to give like a turbine blade sort of effect. And the water comes down this um, four inch pipe here. It's actually less than four inch, I think it's about three and a half inch. It's an old air pipe that we found somewhere else in the mine. And there's a, like a jet. I know you can't see it very well on the camera. Uh, there's a, a jet there directing the water into the wheel. And from the sprocket there, it goes up to this intermediate transmission here to really get the speed up. So you've got a, like a, I can just stop it with my hand like a cog there, just turn my spotlight on so you can see it better, uh, sprog there, it's like a gear cassette off a mountain bike or something, so, uh, intermediate shaft here, this is off an old washing machine, to a pulley here, and then around this side, we've got a, a belt off a 3D printer, and it runs to this, which is a little DC motor. It's a 240 volt DC motor, really cheap. It was about five pound delivered. They're all over eBay. I think they're meant for like food processors or whisks or something. I don't know, um, but uh, you know, they're good. They don't make a lot of power. And this whole wheel doesn't make a lot of power because there's really no pressure. Um, I could turn it on in just a second for you, but we go over to the intake side of the pipe you'll see basically down here there's like a, a grill over the pipe it's a bit of an old air pipe and it's you know there's no head of water there if you like no pressure it's just a bit of flow whatever flows down a three and a half inch pipe which isn't actually very much but it's enough to uh, generate a little bit of power. And if I just turn this light on, you'll be able to see. It's a little bit flickery because the, the, the motor produces quite a, a pulsing DC. A little capacitor in the line would sort that out, no problem at all. That light bulb is six watts. I don't think it's giving out its full welly there. I think it's probably giving out today about four watts. If I spin it a bit more by hand, it goes a little bit brighter. Yeah, so this wheel's good for, yeah, probably yeah, four or five watts, something like that. It's not to be sniffed up. Given that it's, you know, a very small amount of water and it's not even falling any height really the only drop is where it hits the center of the wheel it drops to the bottom of the wheel so there's not really a lot for it to do there it would be more efficient without this intermediate transmission this is used to get the uh, the gear ratio up for higher rpm um, but it's not a it's not like a bearing shaft it's bushes just copper bushes so there is a bit of resistance in in that system there um, so if that was direct drive uh, possibly just using the belt direct to the rear sprocket there, the bottom sprocket. I think that uh, it would have a bit more power. You know, I mean, if, if power was the most important thing here, you know, there's a big cliff there. It just drops like a waterfall for about 15 meters off the end of that. So if you build a, a wheel down there, it'd be, it'd be better. It'd be very difficult to maintain because there's not really any way down there. So it's just a, a novelty really at the moment. It will be used to charge a 12 volt battery, which it will do. Um, but for now, it's just literally lighting that up and that's all it does. Okay, well, thanks for watching.